Standing amidst a bountiful harvest of fruits in a well-appointed bourgeois interior, the woman pictured here turns from her work to engage an unseen interloper in a playful flirtation. As the title implies, if the interloper tries to kiss her, he will receive a dousing of molasses from the spoon in her hand. Lily Martin Spencer won popular acclaim in the mid-19th century with anecdotal kitchen scenes such as this one. Lily Spencer was a rarity in the art world of those years. For most women, this was a hobby, not a working. Lily, however, is an example of a woman who pursued art as a career. In Cincinnati, she married Taylor Benjamin Rush Spencer in 1844. Benjamin Spencer was not able to maintain a permanent job. Therefore, he was managing with the household, which was a very unusual thing in those days for an American family. He devoted himself to family and children. This made Mrs. Spencer the main breadwinner of the family. It was surprisingly, they had an unusual... Spencer's paintings were distributed as affordable engravings that were particularly popular with the emerging market of middle-class women buying art to decorate their homes. Spencer's scenes of domestic life made her the most successful female American artist prior to the Civil War. Despite marrying and having a large family, Spencer became a professional artist, an exceedingly rare accomplishment for a woman at that time, when only about 10% of American women, mostly unmarried, were employed outside the home, many as teachers, nurses,